Calling case number 17-1434, the people of the state of Michigan versus Gregory Green. I'm not happy. I'm not satisfied with the outcome. There's no punishment that fits the crime. Not even torture and death would be justice. Your justice will come when you burn in hell for all eternity, for murdering four innocent children, all because you're insecure as a man. Plus the other two lives you took. You are a con artist. You are a monster. You are a devil in disguise. You are now forever exposed. I've thought over and over again what I would say, even though it doesn't even matter. First of all, I am not and did not and will not suffer like you intended for me to do. What you tried, what you tried to do didn't work. I am and was a damn great mother to all of my children. I carry each one of them in my womb for nine months and raise them. Nothing or no one, sure as hell, not you, can break me or break my bond with them. But while I stand up here trembling with fear, I put on my bravest face to be in the same room with the man who murdered all four of my children. Two of them violently in front of me with the gun, Chadney and Kara. And he killed my other two babies, Coy and Kaylee, with a hose that ran from the tailpipe of his car to where they were innocently sleeping. I just want to say, well, first of all, it's in God's hand. You know, he can judge. Um, you know, I don't, you know, I do regret and I'm sorry for what has happened. Um, um, you know, all I've ever wanted was a um, God-fearing help me, help me that would support me and be faithful no matter what, as well as dedicated to the whole family. You know, I, you know that put aside, I you know I have to be humble, very humble, because God knows the heart, He knows how we grip on how sorry I am. And even now, after all this, He still has a plan. 